اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم پریزنٹیشن آف فائنینشیل اسٹیٹمنٹس ناؤ دا فائنینشیل اسٹیٹمنٹس آر نمبر ون دا اسٹیٹمنٹ آف فائنینشیل پوزیشن ہیئر وی رپورٹ ایسٹس لائبلٹیز اینڈ ایکوٹی دا ڈیٹیل آف ایسٹس اسٹارٹنگ فرام پراپرٹی پلانٹ اینڈ اکوپمنٹ کمنگ ڈاؤن ٹو دی کرنٹ ایسٹس اینڈ دی ادر سائڈ از دی current liabilities, long-term liabilities, and equities. Now, e each of these headings, the numbers of items given. Statement of income and other comprehensive income. In a statement of income, we report revenues. We report the cost of earning those revenues. We also report operating expense. Among operating expense, the administrative expense, selling and distribution expense, and then we have income tax and then we also have finance cost as well so all these things should be reported in the income statement and then we have some other comprehensive income which is not a regular business items maybe some gains or maybe some small investment here and there you did and you are getting money out of it so that should also be given in the comprehensive income now for statement of change on equity is concerned this is totally for the equity shareholders the shareholders of the company what amount they have invested that is the share capital and if they have those shares were issued at a premium so there should be a share premium also and if they have issued let's say right shares or bonus shares all those details should be in this statements the other thing is that if you, in case you have some revaluation of your assets then that those revaluation reserves should also be mentioned there similarly if you have retained profits so retained profits should also be there so in fact whatever you put into the money in the business as a shareholders that will be recorded in these statements and in fact sometime it happens that you buy out your shares from the market any company can buy its own share from the market so that will be reduction out of the share capital and similarly out of retain retain earning if you pay the dividends so that dividend should also be deducted at the end of the day you find out that how much amount is available to the shareholders the notes to the accounts as i said in, they are detailed notes starting from what what the company name is is it whether registered with the stock exchange or not what are their normal businesses that what what accounting uh, follow uh, com convention they followed so all those details are there and the most important one is the accounting policies accounting policies are numbers in fact more than 30 so because each item you reporting you need an accounting policy for that so you need to mention all those accounting policies how, which you are following because once you follow those accounting policies you are not supposed to change over the period change is only allowed in case in case you feel that if we change we will give a better picture to the shareholders only then the change allowed otherwise accounting policies once you opt you are not supposed to change then the comparative comparative is only for the two years i mean current year and the previous year again current year it should be first and then the previous years next and all these figures let me just brief you to okay they are in round figures maybe round up to thousands because we can't give each and every up to the last rupee no it's it's not possible because the figures are so large that we need to condense them into thousands and sometimes even to millions so comparatives we are not supposed to give all the details but only some some items which are very very much important in the income statement balance sheet and uh, statement of change and equity and so for cash flow is concerned now the cash flow is also very important thing here the cash flow is basically the money coming in and the money going out and here you will see completely that absolute money terms because in income statement and balance sheet we have some assumptions so we have some estimates but so for cash flow is concerned there is cash coming in and cash going out 
so we will discuss this cash flow and all these statements in detail thank you very much